Hi, I'm Jeff Wainwright. Uh, I was diagnosed with multiple myeloma 14 and a half years ago. Here I was 50 years old, diagnosed with cancer, had uh, twin nine-year-olds, boy and a girl. Uh, and, uh, you know, I looked on the internet, I saw I might have three years left. Uh, it was just terrible, a terrible time. Uh, fortunately, uh, I went to see Dr. Berenson and immediately he gave me hope. Uh, you know, I looked around his office, I saw, you know, uh, ski posters, ski maps, and I knew at once that we were kindred spirits. Even, even then, <laughs> I couldn't have imagined that here I am 15 years later uh, and still going strong. So uh, I really credit uh, Dr. Berenson's uh, personalized approach uh, and leading edge research uh, to my longevity. So, but uh, best of all, uh, they haven't just been 15 years, they've been 15 great years. Dr. Berenson worked very closely with me uh, over, over this t period to uh, you know, tweak the regimens, to uh, monitor the dosing so that none of it ever interfered with my active lifestyle. Four years after I was diagnosed, uh, I was able to climb Mount Kilimanjaro. Uh, and seven years uh, after, I was able to uh, climb to uh, Everest Base Camp. And uh, these were high points in my life, and I was so overjoyed that, of course, I had to thank Dr. Berenson uh, and his staff uh, at these pinnacles. And in fact, one of those photos is still hanging uh, in Dr. Berenson's office. I also enjoyed another uh, full decade of productive work and uh, now my wife and I are really living a great retirement. Uh, you know, we bike, we ski, we hike, uh, and we do a lot of travel. On one of my international trips, uh, Dr. Berenson even collaborated with a, a Dutch uh, oncologist in Amsterdam so that I could continue my treatment. Uh, and, you know, best of all, of course, uh, and this is really, uh, you know, really gratifying, I was able to attend the graduations, not just uh, from uh, high school, but also college uh, recently for my uh, twin uh, son and daughter. If I look at you know, my experience over the last 15 years, uh, I'm really grateful. There's been so many new drugs that have come uh, to the forefront. And uh, what gives me great confidence is that Dr. Berenson is always leading the way. Uh, as these new drugs are rolled out, uh, often supporting them with original clinical research. Just two treatments uh, lasted seven and a half years. And, you know, and think back when you know, the longevity when I was diagnosed was expected to be maybe three years. So you know, the whole thing is just extraordinary. Um, and so um, you know, I can't thank Dr. Berenson enough. Uh, and uh, I would also say that uh, the work that he does through his research foundation uh, has been very beneficial. Uh, his work on the uh, B-cell maturation antigen, BCMA, uh, I've personally benefited from. Uh, I've seen how uh, in applying that, uh, he's able to monitor my treatment and determine uh, when it isn't working um, earlier than with traditional uh, markers. And uh, of course, that's very critical in managing myeloma. Uh, and then I guess just the last thing I, I'd like to point out, uh, and this is a real intangible, is that uh, Dr. and Deborah Berenson are just this powerhouse positive force. Uh, when I go into uh, the office, I really actually look forward to it. Dr. Berenson, you know, he's on the one hand very serious about myeloma but he is always uh, cracking jokes, maintaining a positive attitude. Uh, in fact, recently, uh, I went into the office for a bone marrow biopsy, which, as I don't have to tell you, that can be uh, an excruciating thing. And with Dr. Berenson, it was, I don't wanna say it was fun, but it was almost bearable because he was, keep, kept it lighthearted, making jokes. Uh, and, um, you know, those are intangibles that have made uh, this a much more uh, palatable journey uh, with multiple myeloma. So, uh, you know, all I can say is uh, thank you, Dr. Berenson and Deborah Berenson. 
uh, for all you do for, for us and for me uh, over almost 15 years.